raise him, raise him till I'm gone. So, uh, the blessings come down when the praises go up. The blessings come down. You know, he says he is the light that lights up every man. So every man that's born has the light of Christ in him. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I was gonna cut it down all the way low, like kind of like 50 Cent does his. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I like my chin here. Hey, you're all all close and personal. about it earlier i was like oh man i don't know and i'm like Sh should i have spent it that i have bought it was this the right investment for what i want to do um, we'll see. i'm so excited that i got it this is so much fun here with my daddy he'll be here about to get his hair did and we're just chilling okay got his beard done <laughs> yeah. Do you want to shout out your shop? Yeah, definitely. Yeah? LA's finest barbershop right here in the city of Lakewood. Come on down. Oh, uh, they are also known as Dr. Clean Thumb. Go ahead and follow me, though. I got that clean thumb. <laughs> The fresh cut. Got the fresh cut took off the whip. Didn't go up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? When, you, when somebody leave the barber chair, you're like, damn, that was, you know, make you look clean. Yeah. Builds your self esteem, makes you feel like a new, new person. So. Beetle with the denim. She up. Oh, hi. Okay, so yeah. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> that was too much excitement but I'm so excited oh my goodness because like y'all gonna see the clips I got on my dad are like so amazing I'm just like yes I get to take this everywhere with me I get to like vlog and when I was talking in there with the with the barbers they're like man that's dope man like you're starting to vlog and I was like yeah <laughs> I didn't say it like that I was like yeah like I was excited and they were saying how they wanted to start and I'm like it's really is just like deciding like one day just like I'm just gonna do it for me because it's fun and like it's just so cool and I'm, I am so glad that I got this camera I can't believe like I'm gonna make it happen I can probably get something for something else if I need to record for a long period of time I keep going back to that because that's the reason why I didn't want to get it at first and I almost didn't get it and playing with it today and seeing the quality of it like I love my other camera like sometimes you just you gotta invest in yourself and it's just so crazy like the emotions that you go through throughout the whole day because seriously in the morning I was like excited and I was like uh and I was excited again and now I'm just excited because now I feel 100% about my decision and and I think that's very important, feeling 100% about the things that you decide on because if it's something, like if you listen to other people, you're not going to feel happy with the things that you do. So I feel so happy about this and I'm just waiting. Um, my dad just ran in really quick and I don't know what we're going to do. Maybe we might see a movie, maybe not, I don't know. And then I just want to take a moment to look at my hands. I never really get like colors. I keep looking at myself, that's what I'm glancing at. <laughs> but I never really get colors and I got some. And I love it. I got gels. And it's just like the bomb.com. Patty is the realest. I hope it could like can it focus on it. Kind of. Kind of get in there. It's like a 
probably insert a picture, but yeah, just having so much fun. <gasps> Give a bear hug. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> I don't even know, like, I feel like I can't even control my excitement right now. Like, it's just too, it's just too much right now. It's just too much. It's so, like, amazing. I thank God every day for the blessings and that I'm even blessed to even purchase this camera like so cool so this was just day one and I have many more days to show but um, yeah let's go okay I need to turn this off <laughs> oh one more quick thing is that I have to say um If you are unsure about something, you give off that energy. Because when I got home, I didn't want to tell anybody where I had went, right? Because I just went to go buy the camera and I felt guilty about spending money on it. Even though it was my money, like, I just felt guilty. So I was just like, I didn't want to say, but I'm not a good liar. So, like, I said, like, oh, I just went to go get something. And then he's like, well, what did you get? And I was like, a camera. And then, like... Then one of the guys asked me how much I paid for it. And then I was like, mm. <laughs> like, I still didn't want to say. After I finally said what I had did and I just owned it and accepted it, then I felt much better about my decision to have purchased it. Like, I just kept getting more excited. And that's what I just wanted to share today, that you have to own what you do. I don't know if I said that already. Did I say that? You got to own what you do. I don't know if I said that already, but you just do. You do. And that is the lesson for today. So... Um, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's, let's stop talking now. Let's just... That's my favorite song. Don't shake I want to show y'all the most beautiful tree. And the whole neighborhood. You're the most beautiful tree in the neighborhood. In the most beautiful tree in the neighborhood. Look like how perfectly, like round it is. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, you're so beautiful. I love you so much, Tree. I do. Oh, you have an Instagram? I have one. I ain't getting that Go add him on Instagram, y'all. What is your Instagram? Instagram is Wise Man Projection. Wise Man Projection. For those of you that don't know my dad, he is wise man. That's his other name. <laughs> Nobody's looking at your codes <laughs> to hack your Instagram. <laughs> you know, Jehovah, you know, give me this trick. I don't know, I pray. Yeah. If Jehovah had me in, I grabbed that hand that was giving coming down. I grabbed it like this and said, bam, 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 bam. And that's it. Boom. And the guy flew. <laughs> But subconsciously, you're being taught. Mm -hmm. this, you know. So I said, that lesson for me was, with God, I could do anything and everything. And that's what he was telling me. I, I keep that guy's And then I said, I'm going to get some ice cream. I'm going to get some ice cream. Go 
gonna get some ice cream. We gonna get some ice cream today. Hooray! What'd you say? So, the way to do it with the ice cream is you can't eat that much, right? You gotta like, you gotta be conservative when it comes to the ice cream. So, I got some ice cream right here. And the way I do it, you just get one spoonful. <laughs> one spoonful is all you need. <laughs> oh, yeah. We in here. We in here with the ice cream. We doing it big. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my goodness. This is so delicious. I promise you this all you need. And the roll. Just try to you try to get the biggest piece you can get because you can't dip it back in there. You can't double dip or nothing. So you try and get as much as you get on the spoon. So you only gotta waste one dish. You don't gotta get no um cup, you don't gotta get no bowl, and you don't gotta feel guilty because you only got one spoonful and it's perfect. It's mm, really perfect. This is good for you. It's organic. <laughs> you better know. Okay, that's it for today. <laughs> I'm scared. I gotta find out where I'm gonna eat. Treats before you eat. Uh, uh, uh. Alrighty, that is the end of the vlog for today. I'm so excited to finish editing because I started editing in the, not the morning, the afternoon. I edit some of it. I'm just excited to see the whole day put together, finally. So yeah, I'll catch y'all in another vlog. This is not the end. This is the beginning of a new start. <laughs> they like they look at me crazy because this, this is the beginning of it. But yeah. You did? I thought I had a hot Yeah, I thought it was. Why did you put that piece of pie in the And the look, I know. That's about. Bye. Bye.